Morning guys. It's, uh, it's on the mazy out to the fire and get a cup of coffee going. Oh, I brought all my fucking shit over, but that's even better. <laughs> Good on you, man. That was, um, I reckon the best night's sleep I've had in that tent on that mattress so far. <laughs> I just fucking yeah, out of it. I fucking was sleeping, but I don't know, man. That tree just felt sound like it was just continuously raining. It must have been rain oh, coming yeah. off, all the moisture coming off the tree. Yeah, we're up in the clouds or something, eh? Yeah. It was beautiful earlier. <laughs> Me and DJ ready to go. Danny, Danny, how are you going there? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What'd you say about getting his tent home, man? He's going to tow it up. Tow it home. <laughs> <laughs> Hook it up. Chainsaw. Yeah, he might need to sleep on the way. <laughs> <laughs> sleep the cows on the fucking you in. <laughs> Mr. Organized. <laughs> You've let us That's down. not me. <laughs> <laughs> Normally you're pretty fucking good. I usually am, yeah. <laughs> oh, we are chuffing off. Back to, I don't know where we're going. Danny said something about, uh, oh yeah, maybe going to your boba or something, get fuel. We have to ring them up, make sure they're open because he's a useless prick. He <laughs> fucking hardly ever opens up on a Sunday. hard to tell if it's like light drizzle or if we're just you know it's heavy condensate like heavy condensation or something up here in the bloody mountains because we're up in the clouds kind of thing it's definitely uh some kind of moisture in the air anyway but anyway we're going down to have a look at some lookout down here so it should be cool if we can get there apparently the track's a little bit gnarly Relax the arms. It's pretty bloody rotted. Yeah, uh, she's a pretty rough old track, but should be doable. Without too much trouble. Danny reckons it's steep going up the other side. Over here. Oh yeah. Which one he's worried about. Yeah, I think so. He's gonna wait back there anyway. He said he's seen it before, so <laughs> he's not keen. Fuck, I don't know if I'm keen either with full tire. Depends how fucking bad it gets around the corner. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Do you want me to go first and have a look? I don't mind. Oh, if you want There, but oh, oh nice there you go eh it's um obviously yeah, very cloudy and misty today but, uh, not bad might as well video coming down you never know I might eat shit No point eating shit if nobody gets to see it. <laughs> it's pretty fucking misty anyway, but... Yeah, you got a photo? Yeah.
camping area, 200 meters, eh? range view, look at that, oh nice. Hey man, did you end up ringing your Bobo? No. Have you got service here? I'll ring him. Yeah, if I've got service, I'll ring him. Fuck yeah. How fucking awesome is that, man? So I look at just over there. So I think the main wee, priority now is uh, getting to a fuel station. I think we're going to head to uh, Merriam Vale. That is if we can get through this track. It's looking pretty interesting. But yeah, man, yeah. there's some cool freaking tracks in here. This is awesome stuff. Got point for a while. Bernie's map was saying it's about 50 odd k's to Maryvale, so we were counting on your Bobo being open, but it ain't open today. So um, our plans that we had for today gone down the pooper. Anyway, it's starting to look like the weather might be coming in. So it might be a good idea to get back on the bitchman. Whoopa! <laughs> Shout out to Marco. Bet this doesn't even look steep on the GoPro. <laughs> it's freaking sketchy. But, but, awesome. Be so much more fun without all the camping gear on. Oh, that bloody big penduluming fucking duffel bag up high on the back rack. It's, uh, it's not good. Shit, man, it'd be fun coming up this hill. When I say fun, I mean interesting. See what we got on the other side here. Shouldn't be too much further back to that campsite. Oh shit. Cool. Oh yeah. Bloody rocky creek beds, eh? Let's send it. bag it does its best to throw you off balance sometimes I wonder if like the bigger 18 litre saddlebags wouldn't be better and just have less shit in the bloody duffel but then you got like a wider load wider versus top heavy you can't win <laughs> fucking hell I can't reach ya. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> Keep going if you want, man. I'm heading back down this freaking hill. DJ made it up, but I think I can hear Danny calling out. I hope he's alright. Oh, you okay? Oh man, I'm fucked. This is fucking gnarly shit, eh? And it keeps going for a while. Does it? Yeah. 
Oh. There's a bit of a switchback up there and then it keeps going. Ready? One, two, three. Jesus, fuck this thing's heavy. Fuck yeah. Fuck, I hope it is in gear. Yeah. Jesus. A bit further. <laughs> you got him? Yeah. Right, eh? Recovered it. We have recovered the 1090. Both of us are sweating like whores in church. Oh, I'll have to get fucking airflow going. Hopefully Danny can get this bloody pig up this hill. Hey Danny boy. Oh shit, oh shit. Doesn't sound like he's got a lot of momentum. Oh, he's up that bit. <laughs> so good. <laughs> that was bad timing. <laughs> now I'm on the hard side. Anyway, we'll let Danny go in front. You're right, dude. If it starts raining, that'll really add to the fun. What? Oh, ready? Oh man, it's fucking heavy. <laughs> oh, that's not going to go from there, is it? If you get me on, man. give you a push. So, DJ, you got to um, hold the push in and hang on before you start it. You got to hold. This one, MTC, traction control and turn it off. Otherwise it won't go anywhere. Yeah, what do I do? Clutch it, clutch it! <laughs> Is that in neutral? Let the clutch out, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Can't do it, bro. Josh. All right, here's the fucking go. Does the MTC stay off? No. No. Oh, fucking cave. Like to get you onto this side, Josh. Yeah. Nah, fuck it, man. I distracted up this one. There should be grip on Can that. A bit of air out. Let me see how it goes. So you gotta start her up first. No, you can do it. I just hold that one in. Yep. What a pain in the ass. Fuck, oh, bro, wait, wait. Your clutch engage is way out. I can barely reach it. Fuck. Oh. Is that going to stay off? Can you take it from here, Danny? Oh, probably not, man. I'm fucking sketchy on this thing, eh? I can barely engage the clutch. My fingers aren't long enough. <laughs> you 
if you get on this side you might be able to maybe not oh, oh hey nah mate I might go back down actually oh, I'm in fucking second gear I was in second! <laughs> My arms are just about fucking dead. I'm gonna set off the uh, PLB. <laughs> are you ready? Not a good place to have a bald tyre. Go the other side, man. Sorry. Oh, they are. <laughs> nice. goes on. I'm getting a little bit worried about this bloody rain coming. This track will be, uh, either, it's bad enough in the dry, put it that way. Danny and I are pretty buggered. Danny's, uh, Danny's on his last legs, I think. He's fucked. I'm bad enough. He, he's, he's worse. Got the jacket off now, it's just too hot. Sweating out all my water. All my fucking salt. At least the track seems a little bit easier now. Danny boy's gone, he's off like a robber's dog. <laughs> so not only have we got the steep freaking hills to worry about, we've got fuel anxiety starting to creep in. We've got, uh, probably going to be getting low on water at some point. And, uh, the rain, the impending rain, possibly. It is supposed to rain this afternoon. Lots of possible thunderstorms and everything, so. I think I really need to get stag pegs on this bike, eh? Hey? My arms are just getting so fatigued going up those hills. I'm not gonna whinge or nothing. <laughs> I've lost. A DJ I'm sitting here for about five or so minutes. Sometimes I think I can hear the bike. There's nothing hard in there, so he might have run out of fuel and had to um, put Tibby's jerry can in the tank. I don't know. Here he comes. I had to put fuel in. Oh, okay. Oh, it fucking come off. Strap went through my back wheel, locked me up, come up the hill. Oh fuck. <laughs> okay, I think we're on our way the fuck out of here. <laughs> what a mission. Oh, poor old Danny's he's, uh, knocked up, eh? <laughs> poor bugger. He doesn't enjoy the struggle. <laughs> 
I don't mind the struggle, I just don't like struggling with other people's bikes, it's, that's, <laughs> it's not my bag. Bullion! Hey! <laughs> jacket on if I come off those speeds. Woohoo! So what down DJ. for a quick dip. I'm keen. Wash some dust off. I got dust off my nose, mm, fucking ears everywhere. Yeah, fucking I blew out a bit of dust this morning when I got up. Oh. Yeah, not a bad little spot. Cool off. Blackman's Gap. Uh, we just uh, got fuel and here in Merionville we're going to uh, grab a bit of a feed and maybe a beer. How are you feeling now, Danny? Be better? Recovery medicine? Vitamin B, <laughs> steak lunch, and I'll be good. Yeah, that's it. How are you feeling, man? Yeah, good. DJ? I need a steak sandwich as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Ooh, it's all ooh. good, but we had to steak keep thinking Danny's bike everything. Yeah, look <laughs> <laughs> at Danny's bike. <laughs> yeah, true, that thing's bloody heavy. We'll have to, we'll have to rate the Miriam Vale like a pub food. Give it a, <laughs> a rating out of five. Before you go, DJ, how would you rate the food? The food? Yeah. 10 out of 10. Oh, it's 5 out of 5, because we were out of 5, wasn't it? Oh, whatever you like. <laughs> no, it was, was it? excellent. What well, do you reckon, Danny? It's Bloody stuck. good, I'll be back. Yeah. <laughs> Four and a half out of 5, 4.7. Yeah, it was good. No, it was good. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah the hamburger was pretty good, too. It wasn't as good well, as Danny's filling, steak actually. up on the... No, yeah, oh, Danny's rotten steak. Like, no, it was... Yeah, like, the rotten steak. That was something else. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Bitumen Highway home. Kind of not really enough time to divert onto any uh, sweet dirt tracks this afternoon, so we're just heading home. Got the earplugs in, gonna crank on some music and just zone out. Popo. The highway is eerily quiet today. A lot of traffic. I wonder if there's uh, an accident or something further south. It's uh, blocking everything up. It's definitely not a lot of cars on this main highway. The A1. One thing worse than fucking highway is 40 km an hour highway roadworks. Fuck. Oh. Don't worry about that. Speedo's out. Gin gin. <laughs> I'll make to the pub again. <laughs> almost to Biggenden. So I don't even always on my sign. I don't have another pair and a half.
Alright, so I'm gonna go home. Alright, man. No worries, take it easy. Yeah, good to see you, man. Same. See you soon. Alrighty. 117 kilometres to Gimpy. I oh, love these guys and girls, paramedics, ambulance crews, man. They scrape up enough of us bloody motorcyclists off the roads and trails. <laughs> Life savers. Good on you guys, You're doing a great job. Respect. Oh, look at this nasty critter. Not sure what kind of snake that was. Sorry about the wind noise guys, I just wanted to stop here real quick and mention a couple of things. Actually I wanted to show you my helmet here. Really lovely innit? But uh, no seriously, uh, this Golden Tide GT723 <laughs> definitely should have been retired a little while ago. Maybe a long time ago. It's only done about 3,500 Ks, I'm surprised. I normally get a fair bit more out of them. But, I mean look at it. It's, it's got nothing. It has got nothing. And <laughs> the shit that it was getting up today, um, very surprising. Also, of course, a couple of supporter shout-outs. I'm, I'm smashing it lately. I remember in every ride, pretty much. First supporter shout is Matt Buchanan. He's somewhere in New South Wales. Thank you, Matt. And the second one is a special shout-out to, of course, Mr. Will from South Australia. He is a DR650 rider. Maybe he's going to get an Africa twin. Anyway, the knee that he busted up not too long ago is finally coming good. I think he's going to be back on the bike soon. So awesome. Good on you, Mr. Will. Thanks for your support. Thanks, Matt. You guys, of course, this fuel tank that's getting me home right now is dedicated to you guys. I doubt whether there's going to be anything interesting on the way home from here, but anyway, we'll see. Shit, I almost forgot. Special mention to Mrs. C. Mr. Will's wife, <laughs> she's a good egg too, thanks guys. Anyway, let's get home, Josh needs a shower and uh, some other items that I won't mention right now. Yeah, I'm talking about poo poo. <laughs> Sunday Arvo cruise home, not bad at all. Oh yeah, back in Helltown and still dry. Looking a bit stormy over there, but I just want to say a big thanks to Danny. Uh, it's good to see you man. Awesome. Always good to catch up. Great to meet you DJ too, a couple of top blokes. Hey, I hope you guys are enjoying this content still because I'm still really enjoying bringing it to you guys. Uh, if you did like it, please, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Hit the little thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, of course, you know what to do. And uh, on that, I guess I'll see you guys on the next adventure.